this simply is not the way that we should do this. It was a complete mess. Uh, it is not reliable in the way that we need this to be reliable when we're starting off the process for electing the most important uh, public servant in our country and in the world. What we do know, what we're able to glean right now is that uh, Senator Warren had a good night. Well, in, in one sense, it's, it's tough because we don't get to have a party tonight knowing what happens. But I am, I'm also a person who wonders why we have to be in such a hurry for democracy anyway. I, I wish we counted paper ballots somewhere and came into things like a week later on, on everything anyway. But when you expect the results and you don't get them, you are disappointed. Not at all surprised. I mean, they're trying a new vendor with new tech. I work in tech. As I knew this was coming. And, uh, yes, absolutely. So the Sanders campaign has nearly 100% of the precincts covered with volunteers, and we did our own reporting, so we've got the receipts, and uh, I'm sure we'll be happy with the results, or if not, we'll let them know what we have. Well, I'd rather them be accurate than rush it. So if we have to wait a couple days, we have to, you know. I um, I don't know what happened. I mean, it seems like, I know it was an app that's not working. So I would think there would be some kind of plan B. I, I, I don't know. So I'm disappointed. I won't lie. I wouldn't say it's concerning. Um, you know, technology can fail on us, and we have to go the old-fashioned way and count them by hand. That's what we have to do. I think by counting them the old-fashioned way, we're going to get a really solid total that really can't be, you know, said, no, that's not how it happens. So.